Well, just behind her, Summer Daniels, our Bellator girls letting us know it is round number two of this featherweight fight. Our judges tonight have been assigned by the California State Athletic Commission. How about it for you, Jimmy, round one? 10-9 uh, for John Teixeira. He was the aggressor. He was throwing the bigger punches. Landed a few of them, but basically that aggression wins him round number one. As he did through much of round number one, Teixeira opens round number two by coming forward. See the power of Gehetto pushing Teixeira back. Get off the shorts, John. Looking for the outside trip. Get off the fence. This is a position you can't hold. You have to use, and he loses it. It's been a loopy left hand and the winging right hook. Those have been the two punches of Teixeira, the overhand right and the left. And that right just landed. Teixeira senses it, turning up the aggression. There's the clipping left followed by the hard right hand. Teixeira right back into the pocket. I don't know now, Jimmy, really forced to counter. I've yet to see anything from Guerrero where I'm thinking, okay, this is what he trained offensively. This was his game plan going in. You know, he's, he's done a good job, you know, throwing the jab occasionally and keeping Teixeira back, but that's not going to win you a fight. I haven't seen what his offensive preparation was. I haven't seen that yet. He's been in on a couple of takedowns, hasn't been able to finish them. Not enough to just not get hit. We talked about being patient, but you can only be patient yeah, for so only long. only be patient for so long. <laughs> sure, throwing a lot of power off of that lead left hand. Could be waiting for Teixeira to wear down, but that's always a risky strategy. It's easy to lose two rounds waiting for your opponent to get slow. It's not that pace of a fight, at least not yet, where you yeah, think someone's yeah, going to wear out. Exactly. But that's always a risky strategy. It's easy to lose two rounds waiting for your opponent to get slow. Not that pacing. Teixeira continually coming forward. There's the counter jab from Gehetto. Teixeira, Jimmy, walking through. Did you say there's nothing following that jab? For the takedown, Teixeira hits it with authority from the waist edge. Gehetto in an E-bar leg lock position. He's going to turn. Not diving through his legs for that submission. Gehetto trying to isolate the wrist. Yeah, it's hard to finish from here, though. Doesn't have his hips engaged in the right position. He's giving Teixeira an opportunity to step over and take his back. Same thing we saw with Pitbull and Daniel Strauss. Now arm triangle trouble. That's what Teixeira is looking to set up. Keep that head low. Keep that arm trapped. Gehetto trying to keep that elbow on the ground. Gehetto able to get his guard back, can't finish your arm trying to go from here and he loses it. Gehetto pulling his right arm out. Two punches on the bottom, now to the left hand for Gehetto. Heavy top pressure from John Teixeira. Gotta work, John. Call for action from Milan Ayers. You heard that, you've got to work, John. From guard from Gehetto. Once again, going for the Kimura, letting Teixeira step behind him. Step back behind, step stay. over, and the full back mount, both hooks in. Now looking for the standing rear naked choke to finish his dog, John Teixeira. 15 seconds remaining, round number two. Teixeira trying to find it. On the chin, not on the neck. Ten seconds, guys. Now, there's enough time to finish it. We really have to get it under the chin. I don't think he has time to do it. <laughs> the roll from Gehetto out of danger. Here comes the third and final round. Ah, pode respirar, pode respirar, respira, controla a respiração. Brother, tá perfeito, tá show, é isso aí que eu quero. Quero só que você mantenha essa pressão o tempo todo, movimentando, tá certinho. Vem quando o movimento ele vem bater, você solta junto, ele tá perdido, ele tá morto. Ele não tem mais o que fazer, ele vai vir por tudo ou nada. Então vamos cozinhar, você ganhou os dois rounds. Se puder censurar, botar ele no chão, tá ótimo, fica ali, mas... 
Gehedo trying to get his jab going, but Teixeira moving him back with power punches. Teixeira finally getting inside. Look at the waist cinch takedown. I liked his progression on the ground, taking advantage of the mistakes of Gehedo fishing for the